Mike, I know for you guys, you're a big GoPro user in this. Oh, server. huge. So huge talk, a little, talk a little bit about how you're using your GoPro. Well, GoPro's kind of gone through a lot of iterations, and the hardware keeps getting better in terms of photo quality, so I'm sure, um, you know, Mike can talk to that, but in terms of just usefulness, these things are absolutely fantastic. So the best part about them, obviously, I mean, everyone knows about the GoPros is that they're waterproof. Waterproof, shockproof, dustproof. You can take them anywhere, and the thing, the next best part about them is that they're tiny. So even if you take this thing off the uh, selfie stick that we have it on here, I mean, it's super small. We take it on all of our vacations, um, wherever we go. So it's pretty much the most universal camera you can have for any sort of water vacation. So we took ours down to Mexico. We take it to the lake. We do all sorts of pictures with it. I have about, I've collected over the years all sorts of mounts. So I have the one that can go on the head. I have the chest mount. Uh, but probably the most useful is obviously the selfie stick. This, I've never thought I would use one of these devices, but it's perfect for the GoPro. As you are doing any sort of activity, you can just have it out there. Um, we use it for while we dirt bike down at the farm. We use it while we four-wheel ride. All sorts of uses for these GoPros. Um, but from a tech standpoint, the cool thing is that it connects to an app on your phone. So this thing actually creates its own Wi-Fi network. And because it's Wi-Fi, not Bluetooth, it's actually a pretty good range. You can actually put this thing pretty far away and control it from an app on your phone, or they actually sell a remote for it. So you can uh, you can have a buddy using it out on the dirt bike, and you can be kind of looking and seeing what he's seeing and recording or changing the mode from picture mode to video mode, all sorts of uses um, for these GoPro. But pretty much the thing I like about it is it's small enough that you can pack away and put into a suitcase, uh, but also extremely useful and very high-quality video and images coming out of these. So, yeah, they're fantastic. Mike, so you've got the selfie stick piece of it. You've got a cover for it that makes it yeah. waterproof. Did you get... Did you get a stick, a sticky, you know, like a suction cup so you can stick it yeah, to stuff I as have, well? I have, yeah, I kind of have a bunch of them. I have one that's permanently on my dirt bike helmet, and I have, uh, like I said, you know, the chest one, the one that goes on your head, the, oh, there's all sorts of mounts that you can get for these things, and they're just, they're very yeah. versatile. So. What's your favorite video so far? I mean, that you've done, that when you got done, you're like, man, I'm really glad I shot that video. Um, actually, some of the pictures I like taking are like jumping off of a boat. Now, what I've learned from this thing is that the instinct when you get a GoPro, especially if you are like riding or doing anything, is to face out and try and get people to see what you see. That's just, it, it's, it's okay. It turns out to be a cool video. But what the coolest videos are, turn it around and have it face you. Uh, when you think of all the cool GoPro commercials you're seeing, you're seeing the people doing the activities. That's kind of the fun part. So I like it when we've done cliff jumping. Uh, you kind of get a really cool perspective of the cliff jump. Uh, when you do any sort of, uh, you know, just even jumping off the boat or, or riding the dirt bike is kind of fun. But I also used it, I have a mount that goes on the end of my gun. So when I've been turkey hunting, I've been able to take photos of like me what? in the stand or out towards the turkey. Oh, hold on, you have a mount that goes on the end of your gun. Yeah, yeah. Seriously. My buddy, my buddy got it for me. My buddy actually is a friend um, or family member, works for GoPro. So he gets them on oh, disc. that's like, awesome. You got to try this. I'm like, that's okay, awesome. yeah. So mounts right underneath your gun or to your fishing pole. So it's kind of fun. No, very cool. Um, I watch a lot of people go down slides, you know, like water slides or yeah. roller coasters doing the selfie, you know. Um, I watch somebody put it on the end of a hula hoop and, oh, and that would be hula cool. around, right? And so you got this really interesting perspective yeah. as it you know, as it comes around. What we did was, um, actually, I worked for the company that hosted the International Horse Show. I don't know if you know about that. The one at the CenturyLink just started two years ago, but it's a big horse equestrian competition. And I was working for them, and I said, hey, I could can, can I put my GoPro out on the jump? And they said, yeah, sure, but how are you going to control it? I'm like, well, since it's Wi-Fi, I can sit in the stands, and I can tell it when to start recording, when to stop. So during the show, I put it right on the thing, so you get these horses coming right up and over the GoPro. And they it was let a really you do that, cool huh? kind of image. Yeah, yeah they, they did weren't, it. They weren't concerned that that might freak out the horses? or I, mean, I had I to cover up the light and turn off the sound. So okay. it was just it was kind of hidden in the bushes right underneath the wow. jump. And I turned off the light and turned off the sound, and it was—it turned out really cool. They're just very versatile cameras. Is yeah, what I've been learning. So uh, some new ones out. Uh, I think we're on the four, right? You have a Hero Three, and I think we're on the four at this point. Yeah, and, and, and they any... even just came out with the brand new one, which now I'm gonna forget the name. I was actually just wanting to buy one. <laughs> uh, uh, man, it can be expensive. Oh those those things run what about three fifty? They get up there. So the new one's called the Session, and it's actually just the square. If you look at it, if you look at the black part of this camera, it's that size. It's tiny. I mean, it's super small. And that one is going to start at $400. They have the Hero 4 Black for 500 
the silver back at four, and then I believe they have one cheaper one like at 150. I think you can can get an entry model uh, that's a little bit lower, maybe 150 or 200. So. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So so that's a that's a perfect summer gadget, right? That's one of those kinds of things. And you know, a GoPro is a great winter gadget too. If you think about skiing and put it on your helmet, strap it yes. on your chest. We did that as well. Yeah, it was you know, awesome. Those, those kinds of things. And so a great selfie back to school ski. gift for students going off. You think of you know them wanting to capture moments and especially anything that they do. If they do anything outside at all, um, a GoPro is a great camera. So Mark uh, had said again in chat uh, that he has pictures from a ride through the Australian rainforest on dirt bike. Oh, wow. Recorded on a video on the way out and stills on the way back from a GoPro. That's fantastic. That would be great. Yeah. That would be great. Yeah, it's just such a durable camera. I think that's one of those things oh, it is. that out. Uh, the nice thing about a GoPro, especially the cases that you have, those are all fairly rugged, durable cases, right? Well, and that's that what we did. So on our honeymoon, we went down and we left the phones in the room locked into the safe. One, because it got us disconnected from reality. It was awesome. We loved doing that. But two, because we use this as our entire camera for everything. We took it on, uh, yeah, horseback riding, rock water slides, everything like that. And you don't have to worry about it. You can chuck this thing at a rock and it's not going to break. And if it does, they'll replace it for free. So Yeah. Yeah, yep. it's just a good way to have a camera on you. 